Please authorize repair. Alright creators, imagine giving life to your AI images with just one click. That's exactly what Leonardo AI just made possible. If you're building a faceless YouTube channel using tools like Leonardo AI or love experimenting with AI tools, this update is going to blow your mind. What's up boys and girls? Welcome back to another chapter of AI News. So I opened up Leonardo AI the other day and boom, major update. Leonardo AI just launched motion control for your images. If you've used Leonardo before, you probably remember the original add motion feature for still images. It was cool, and I actually used it in my video about faceless channels. But now, you've got real control over your generations. According to Leonardo AI, you can add dynamic camera shots and predictable movements. And that's not all. They tease that full video generation is coming soon too. So naturally, I had to make this tutorial for you guys, because Leonardo AI just became a serious AI video generator. The images you just saw were created entirely with Leonardo AI and animated using their brand new motion feature. Let's test it out together. Head over to your dashboard and take a look. There are tons of features and creative inspiration all over the Leonardo AI feed. I dove right into the new motion control tool using some images of a pink haired woman I had ready to animate. The dashboard looks great. You'll notice there are more models coming soon, which is super exciting. Inside the motion control section, you can now choose camera movements like crane up, dolly in, dolly out, orbit left, and even special effects like disintegration or explosion. For style, you can set the vibe, lighting, and color theme of your image. You can also choose different aspect ratios. As of recording this video, only fast generation is available and it's limited to 480p, but higher resolutions are on the way. I always leave prompt enhance set to automatic on because I like how Leonardo fine tunes my prompts behind the scenes. This was just a quick tour of what's available. Let's pick an image generated using the Leonardo AI Phoenix model. Click generate video and see how the new Leonardo AI motion control works in real time. Write a quick prompt and make sure you have Leonardo AI motion 2.0 selected, then pick your camera movement. All right, I'm going with dolly in. Prompt enhance is on. Smooth video is on to make the transitions fluid. We're spending 250 credits for this generation. Once you hit generate, the prompt is auto enhanced for motion 2.0 with extra details, which honestly saves time and effort. And just like that, here's our result. We're turning stills into videos using the Leonardo AI image to motion pipeline. What do you guys think? Let's break down these animated clips. We'll rate each one on a scale of one to five, with five being mind blowing and one, well, let's just say it needs a little coffee. We'll be judging based on prompt accuracy, background motion, subject motion, visual appeal, and wow factor. Let's start with this one. The prompt says, woman smiles, then laughs, head tilting slightly, eyes crinkling. Close up slowly zooms out. Watching the scene, I'd say it nailed the prompt. Background motion, super believable. Subject motion, really natural. The facial expressions feel human, visually, beautiful. And the wow factor, I loved it. If this were in 4K, it'd be next level. For now, this gets a five out of five. Sure, you'll get some weird results here and there, but honestly, if you know how to prompt well, this tool is fire. Here's another test. The prompt includes a zoom out, revealing the woman's shoulders, giving the idea of expanding the scene. Subject motion, great. Background, looks clean. Visual appeal, nice. But overall, I'd rate this one a three, just because the motion wasn't as strong as the other one, and it didn't follow the prompt accurately. This next test used the orbit left movement. The enhanced prompt had the woman walking toward the camera. I think the motion in just five seconds is pretty solid. 
The way she turns and the camera moves makes it feel cinematic. It didn't follow the prompt perfectly, so I'll give it a 4, but that's understandable with such a short clip. Would you like a full tutorial on how to use Leonardo AI to get pro-level results? Drop a comment and I'll make it happen. Now for this shot, Leonardo AI followed the prompt pretty well. I love the subject's motion, but the people on the left in the background move a bit awkwardly. Visually, it's one of my favorite scenes. It looks amazing, but I'm giving it a 4. But feel free to drop your own rating in the comments. Now what do you think of this one, guys? The prompt says, slowly winks, then smiles. And I use the crane down camera movement. Personally, I think it followed the prompt well. The background looks good, the subject's motion feels soft and feminine, and overall it looks pretty natural. But I don't know. It's kind of missing that wow factor, isn't it? Alright, alright, I think I'm falling in love with this one. The prompt says she smiles serenely while explosions bloom behind her, and for this shot, I use the explosion effect. I don't know about you, but I'm giving it a 5, especially for that wow factor. When I was editing this video, I thought to myself, oh my, this shot is so cinematic. From now on, Leonardo AI is definitely going to be one of my go-to AI tools for generating videos, especially once they level up the resolution. Alright, now let's push the motion control feature a little further. Those first tests were close-ups of a single subject, which are easy to animate. But what happens when the scene gets more complex? I browsed Leonardo AI's feed for inspiration and created my own detailed prompts. I used the Leonardo AI Phoenix model to generate these images. Let's choose one, add camera movement, and see how well it follows the instructions. This time, you be the judge. Let me know in the comments if you'd like the prompt I used to generate these images. So, would you try this new feature? If you're wondering how to get better motion with Leonardo AI, here's what I've learned. First, choose the aspect ratio that fits your platform. For example, 916 if you're planning to create YouTube shorts or Instagram reels. Keep prompt enhance turned on if you want Leonardo AI to add extra detail to your prompt automatically. Or turn it off if you prefer full control over every word. And don't forget to experiment with the camera movement presets. It saves you from having to write them into the prompt yourself. Want to see more results from this AI video generator? I've got some wild ones coming up. And if you're into boosting your content quality, make sure to stick around till the end. I'll show you exactly which AI video enhancer I used to take these clips to the next level. Because if you ever wondered how to upscale video quality without spending hours editing or losing clarity, trust me, you'll want to see this. Keep watching. Now here's a quick tip, I went to CapCut Online, then to Magic Tools, then clicked Video Upscaler and uploaded each clip. It's not perfect for every device, but it gives you solid quality fast and for free. Another great option is Polo AI. It lets you upscale videos to 4K resolution in under 60 seconds. You can download watermark free results with a paid plan. And the best part? They give you free credits just for checking in daily. You can try it right now using the link in the description. Yo guys, let's recap real quick. 
As of this recording, Leonardo AI Motion 2.0 currently supports 480p resolution. Each generation costs 250 credits. Each Leonardo AI Motion video is 5 seconds long. You can choose your motion type and camera movement using presets, and you can upscale using external tools like CapCut or Polo AI. Personally, I think Leonardo AI's new video generator is surprisingly powerful. Leonardo already has some of the best AI models for image generation, and now they're bringing those visuals to life. I'm seriously excited to see what they roll out next. I think Leonardo AI just became a serious AI video generator. Would you like a full tutorial on Leonardo AI? I've been playing around with this platform for months, so let me know in the comments and I'll make it happen. Alright guys, happy creating and I'll see you in the next one.